Hello YouTube fans, some of my beautiful artwork, don't get excited, I'm not selling you anything naughty. Barbarian Queen, as I do like my fans to do fencer films, get ready for Barbarian Queen. You may remember the star or the actress appeared in the original Deathstalker. That's the warrior woman who Deathstalker had his bit of umpty dumpty with. Linda Tartan was her name, may she rest in peace. But I'll talk about what happened to her another time, who sadly got lost her life to a some selfish person. But this is more about the film. Linda Tartan is about to get married as the character. A couple of evil knights run along, raid a village and basically massacre a family. Her and a band of women and her sister decide to make their own team to get revenge. That being the Barbarian Queen. Shot in 1985, you could say this is like a female version of Job the Barbarian. You can see by the beautiful art cover, it definitely sells. It also pisses me off that they don't make art covers like this anymore. I love to see Linka Tartan as the role. To me, it's like what would have happened if they had she the movie. We already had Masters of the Universe in 87. And it makes me sad that Linka Tartan is no longer with us. May she rest in peace. But, as we know... We never had she the movie, but after seeing her as Barbarian Queen, I felt she would have been awesome as in she a movie version, rather than the animated cartoon that was shot in 84. However, Barbarian Queen does have scenes where she gets tattered, tortured, and about to be sexually murdered. But being Barbarian Queen, she definitely kicks ass. She gets her revenge, saves her old bear, and basically kills the bad guy. Or it's not her, it's her sister. A couple of years later they made a sequel, Barbarian Queen 2, The Empire Stites Back. How's that for getting into trouble for copyright? Do it sound like a movie you've sound be heard before? But they managed to get away with that one. Again, had a linger tartan. And the hell with it, I'll tell you the sad story. Linga Tartan was shopping, just doing her everyday shopping, and some stumbag went into the shop and shot loads of innocent people, you know, like you get in America. Linga Tartan, being in the one place and at the one time, got shot with all these innocent people, and that is why she's no longer with us. May she rest in peace. I didn't think she was set, sir. She definitely kicked ass, and she definitely played that role to a T. For a tip up to her, I do think Barbarian Queen isn't that bad. Granted, the DVD I've got is a typical video rip, which you sometimes do get in certain DVDs. But it's still not a bad film. If you're going into it for Buccaneer and Benzer, the art cover can really be fooling. But for dull Barbarian rip-offs, it's not really that bad. So for that, I'll give it a two star rating. Because it's pretty good to see an error of the videos, what really sold, and what was your typical warrior and fancy adventure films. Other than that, have a good one.